Yo, what it is, man? Thug Alarm, Mark Eight Double Seven, and another that impressive video. Everyone watching this video, and today's video topic is stop telling women about your past. So, with that being said, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, share the video. I got more content coming to touch on what I'm gonna do. Let's dive into it. So, check me out. This video is very important. We're gonna be talking about relationships. Yes, relationships. Okay, listen, as a man, right? Stop telling women about your past. Okay, listen, a woman doesn't need to know about your past for a various amount of reasons okay listen it's okay to give her a little rundown or a little summary but you don't have to go in depth about all the shit you've been through because listen as a man right when you get into a relationship it should be about what you guys are going to create what is going to go down in your relationship what future are you guys going to have okay stop telling women about your past because listen nine times out of ten a woman doesn't really care about your past you feel me she doesn't care. She does not care about your past, okay? She wants to know you and learn about you, but she's not gonna care about all the heartbreak, all the pain you've been through, all the past relationships, because listen, that don't have shit to do with her in a way. Yes, I know a lot of you guys think like, oh, she my girlfriend, so I just gotta tell her all the heartbreaks, all the shit people put me through. Nah, man, when you get in a relationship with a woman, it should be about what y'all gonna build, what y'all gonna create, you feel me? Real shit, stop telling women about your past, man. That shit is pointless, whoa. When you get with a woman, the first thing that should be on both of y'all minds is what are we going to do together? What are we going to accomplish in this life, okay? Listen, when you with this woman, it's a new beginning, all right? Everything that happened as far as with other relationships, shit you've been through, listen, it does not pertain to her, okay? I'm not telling her you can't, I'm not telling you you can't tell her about your life a little bit, you feel me? But even then, she don't need to know all that shit. She don't need to know all the pain you've been through because one, as a man, that's between you and the most high, you feel me? That's between you and the most high, you feel me? You don't gotta tell her your past, bro. It should be about what the fuck y'all are going to create. And when you do this, bro, a woman is going to respect you, a woman is going to see you as alpha because listen, Women, believe it or not, they try to test your masculinity. This is how they test your masculinity. By the way, this video is out the top. They test your masculinity to see where are you at mentally because you got to understand the dynamics of masculinity and femininity, all right? A masculine man, right? He is supposed to constantly be moving forward. That means no matter what has happened, no matter what's taken place in his life, no matter what situation has occurred with him, he constantly moving forward, you feel me? So, women, right? Subconsciously or unconsciously, they will test you. They may ask you questions about, let me get this car pass. This motorcycle got me pass. Anyways, like I was saying, subconsciously and unconsciously, right? A woman will ask you about your past. She may try to ask you about past relationships just to see if you are still dealing with some type of heartbreak or just that in the third. And believe it or not, when you start expressing your pain to women, you look feminine, you look bitch made, bruh. Because as a man, you're not supposed to be so emotional. Listen, I'm not saying you can't be emotional, but you gotta learn to suppress that shit. That's how it's supposed to be as a man. You feel me? You gotta go face that shit yourself. You and the most high, go talk to the most high about that. Don't be talking to her about shit you been through and shit all the time like that, man. She don't care, whoa. She care about what y'all gonna go through. What's happening with y'all? You feel me? Stop telling women about your past, man. She don't give a fuck, man. She trying to see, are y'all going to create something beautiful together? You feel me? What memories are you guys going to make? That's all she care about. And that's the mindset you got to have when you're dealing with women. Even if a woman may have done you wrong in the past, it don't matter, whoa. You don't go telling your next woman you get with, oh, I've had women do this, I had women do that. It, it, it make her think of you as like, okay, he... He's too emotional, he's beta, he doesn't have options, you feel me? Y'all cannot go into relationships trying to tell women about your past and what you've been through. She don't care, whoa. She care about what the fuck you are doing with your life right now, where are you headed, and she's trying to see if you are going to continue to move forward in life and allow her to be a part of your journey, okay? She does not care about your past, whoa. She don't care. Y'all think women care about your past, but when you start venting and expressing yourself to these women, let me tell you what happened. She literally views you as beta. Like, believe it or not, she don't want you to tell her all the heartbreaks and shit that she been through, that you been through, because she's like, wow. Like, you're really telling me this shit? I don't really care. I just want to see 
if you are an emotional ass man, believe it or not, men want, my bad, let me scratch that. Women want non-emotional ass men, bruh. You feel me? It don't matter if you went through hell in this life, okay? You don't go vetting and telling her all the pain you've been through because she don't care, well. Most of these women, fuck that. All women really don't care like that. They don't care, G. They trying to see what's up with you and her. So stop telling these women about all the shit you've been through, man. Y'all be telling women about shit that's irrelevant. Like, who cares, G? Who cares? You think she care about your past relationship? Huh? You be telling, you niggas be telling hoes, oh, I done had so many bitches cheat on me and this, that, and the third. She looking at you like, okay. And then, on top of that, <laughs> she just views you so full, whoa. Stop telling women about your past, man. I'm telling you. Y'all need to be talking about what y'all gonna create and build, well. That's it. She don't care, man. Get that through your head as a man. Y'all think women be caring about y'all past like that? They really don't, well. Like, they could care less, to be real. All they wanna know is, is me and you or you and her gonna be something good together? That's it. She don't care about you, bro. And I'm not trying to say care about you. I meant to say she don't care about your past. All right? She don't care about the heartbreak, the pain, none of that shit. Because listen, as a masculine man or a man, right? You are designed to be non-emotional, okay? You got to just take life head on. Because as a man, the most high knows that you are going to go through adversity, okay? Women love strong men who can keep moving forward. Believe it or not, you know, certain women may know what you have been through and off the strength of you just staying focused and not giving a fuck and just keeping your head high. You don't know how women really view you. They view you as strong, bro. They love strong men. Strong men who are not emotional. I'm talking about a lot of you chosen ones have been through great hell and some of the women from your past may have heard some things that you have been through. And they see you just not complaining, still staying focused, still moving forward, still elevating. That, that shit turns women on, bro. Because as a man, you're supposed to be masculine. You're supposed to be non-emotional. I'm starting to understand it now. You feel me? Life gonna hit you hard. But listen, you are a fucking man. God did not create you to be a man, bro. You are not a man just to be a man. Now, you always have been a man in other past lives. You will never become a woman, this, that, and the third. I hope you know that. If you are a man now, you have, you have always been a man. A man, okay? It's in your, it's in your uh, DNA to be a man. You will never be a woman, okay? So get that deal. Hey, don't, I don't want y'all to think y'all was women in the past. Nah, you will always be a man. I have always been a man for eons. Reincarnation is very real. I will always become a man. You feel me? So listen, women view you as alpha when they see that you're non-emotional. Okay, let me repeat what I just said. Women, some of you chosen ones know that women know what you've been through in this life, right? And when they see that you're not emotional or complaining about things people have put you through and you just handling that shit like a man is supposed to, it turns them on. It makes them look at you like, wow. Because believe it or not, women, it's in their DNA. It's in their genetics. They love masculine, non-emotional men. So... When you keeping your head up out here and you just staying focused, you staying bold, resilient, you on your shit, women instinctively can pick up on that. They really can. Y'all think women is not hardwired to pick up on certain things. Women is very intelligent. Never sleep on women. Never underestimate a woman, okay? Real shit. I mean that on every level. Never underestimate a woman, all right? Real shit. Women can pick up on a lot of things and they see a man with strength, okay? Women love strong men. Women love masculine men. Women do not love weak men, bruh. A lot of y'all think y'all strong, but y'all really weak. And when a woman won't tell you, she just will show it through her actions. That's the thing about modern women in this society. They will show you, but they won't tell you, okay? They'll show you that you're weak by their actions, but they won't tell you that you're a weak man, okay? However, they'll show you that you are a strong man based off their actions as well. They're not... They're not going to really tell you that you're a strong man, but you'll feel it and pick up on it that she knows you're alpha, she knows you're confident, she knows you're resilient, she knows you're masculine as fuck. I'm telling you, masculinity is key. You got to become masculine. If you stay beta, you ain't going to make it. Your women ain't going to be good. You're going to get played by women. You're not going to get no respect from women because, listen, women don't respect beta males. Women don't respect weak men. Okay? Women do not like simps. Women like alpha masculine guys. Okay? 
I'm a masculine guy. If you are a boy watching this video, I'm trying to help you become a masculine guy so you, su so you can succeed in this life, okay? So anyways, let me repeat this shit one more time. Stop telling women about your past, bro. She does not care, well. She does not care. If a woman wants to come into your life, it's so you guys can create something together and create new memories, okay? A woman does not want you to be still living in the past, okay? Because listen, women live in the past. Men, we do not necessarily live in the past. It's not in our DNA to necessarily live in the past. Now, certain men who are bitch made, feminine ass niggas, these devils, they live in the past. But real righteous masculine men, we always moving forward and we're just trying to become better. We're trying to heal, we're trying to fix ourselves, we're trying to fix society, okay? So hey, I'm telling you the damn truth. Stop telling women about your past, man. And start telling her about what you plan on doing in the future. That's all she care about, whoa. Real shit. That's all she care about. What are you going to do in the near future? What are you going to do now with your life? She don't care about the past, man. Shit. Women will literally ask you about certain shit just to see if you still hurting. And even if you is hurting, you don't show her that you hurting, motherfucker. That's masculinity. Shit, if you hurting, you gonna face that shit yourself eternally. Do some shadow work or meditation or go pray to the Most High, whatever you believe in. You feel me? Never show men that, show a woman that you emotional, bro. And you feel me? That's, that's just not it. You feel me? You don't show her that you emotional, but you ain't gotta necessarily show it. She know if you emotional or not based off your actions. But you feel me? As a man, you got feelings and shit like that. You feel me? You just go face that shit with yourself or you go face the most high. Talk to the most high. Pray to the most high. Tell them about your shit, man, if you hurting for real. But you don't go tell a woman about your past, man, or what hurt you, man. What the fuck? That's what she wants you to do. Oh, he a weak man. He's still hurting. He still ain't moving forward. Oh. And they, when they believe it, y'all think y'all be getting saucy when a bitch act like she care like that? Nah, man. Because you care about the past. So why the fuck would she care about your past? Right? You, you feel me? A lot of y'all think I'm just talking out my ass. I'm telling you real shit. Why would she care about your past? She caring about her own past. She coming to you to create and build something new. You women don't care about your past like that, man. You feel me? They don't care, bro. They don't care about what you've been through, bro. They don't care about who hurt you, what women cheated on you, played you, this, that, and she don't care about that, man. I'm telling you the truth, cuz. All she care about is what are you going to do now in life and what are you going to bring to the table in the near future for yourself? Maybe if y'all somehow have children and the family, all that shit, you feel me? The fuck? I don't know what the fuck. But for real, real shit though. Real shit. So yes, stop telling women about your past, man. Y'all stay focused. I love you guys so much. Y'all stay tuned for more content. And yeah, thug on my gang.